Have you ever seen anything as crazy as that? A throwing knife being used to take down an enemy aircraft. Callum Josh is next. This is going to be a tank kill streak on Narvik, blasting onto Alpha Objective. He's using these mine clearers. I absolutely love these. They are so useful in these close quarters situations, especially if the enemies are bunched up and there's a few buildings to also add to the kill feed with the debris. A big point stack on Alpha. So many players around here and they just don't deal with the tank and all pay the consequences. Two clips from EN98, we haven't seen him in the top plays for a little while, great to see him return with a Lee Enfield sniping streak to headshots that he manages to get in this clip are fantastic, even the ones with his revolver, just super satisfying. The second clip he sent in is on aerodrome using the Gewehr M95, a big point stack and a bunch of headshots. Matter Wow is next. One of my favorite clips in the top plays has to be this one. He's in the top of a building with a friend and a squad mate who's just been taken down. He clears the first floor and now he looks for the enemies pushing up from the ground floor. As they come up the stairs, he blasts them with his shotgun in a massive kill feed. That's awesome. Holy shit! This episode of the Battlefield Top Plays is sponsored by Instant Gaming. Thanks to them for helping out this channel and supporting this series. It's great to have them on board. If you're looking for some cheap games, whether it's on any of the consoles or, of course, the PC, you can find the link in the description down below that will take you through to the website. Loads of great deals there, no matter what game you're looking for. And, of course, with it coming up to Christmas, I always say this. Buy a friend a game, you can gift it via the website, a really nice thing to do. And of course, it's a really cheap way as well because you'll be getting a discount at the same time. Check out the link in the description below. Stevastatings managed to pick up 12 kills in 19 seconds. A couple of smoke grenades go down, pushes towards the enemy players, and there you go, as easy as that. A triple to start us off before he goes and finds nine more in this amazing kill streak. Quick one from Prophet RKS, a six man using the Lee Enfield, a really satisfying clip this as you can see how he sets up the kill feed beforehand, dropping down some smokes to mask his attack, a couple of flares in the air so he can see some players spotted and he knows where the enemies are, picking up a bunch of headshots. Really? Really? I'm not going to try and pronounce that name, but the clip is definitely worth commentating over. This one is going to be a Devastation of Rotterdam clip. Playing in this squad call-in tank, you can jump onto the grenade launcher and cause absolute havoc. There's no ammo restrictions, as you might expect there would be on Battlefield 5, but no, trust me, there are not. You can spam this all day long. Massive grenades that cause a huge amount of damage and completely dominate the objective. So many points in this one.
A handful of clips left in today's episode, this one from Enders, is entitled The Greatest Arty Strike Ever. Well, let's see how many kills he picks up with this really powerful squad calling. Next up is Duff Daddy, a similar clip but on a different map, dropping in the squad calling artillery onto the objective and then using this STG to pick up a few kills as well. A big point stack. And finally today, two clips from Pindaz showing that he's not just all about those amazing plane streaks. This one is a sniping streak using the Car 98K. Iron sights as well for extra points. A really nice streak. And finally, the second clip from Pindaz is pushing through on Alpha Objective, going aggressive with the Lee Enfield Iron Sights on Operation Underground. Thanks for watching this episode of the Battlefield Top Plays. If you did enjoy, consider leaving a like down below. You can also find the players' channels in the description. And if you've got any clips yourself, you can send them in to battlefieldtopplays at gmail.com. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next episode.